Hello Nuggets. It's your favorite TT from Divine Me 1111 Spiritual Guidance. I hope you all are doing well. We're going to get into the weekly energies for cancer. If you guys need to get in contact with me for personal, the information is down in the description box along with um, links to Facebook, IG, and Twitter for services and um, products and whatever inspiration you may need, okay? All right, Cancer, so your uh, channel song was John B. Don't listen to... They don't know. That's what it's called. I'm saying the lyrics, and I'm uh, not giving you the title of the song. It says, uh, the title is They Don't Know. So, um, yeah. Let's go ahead and get TT's Music Oracle for Cancer. There's two of them right there. And get one more. All right. All right. One more. All right. We have In Love With You by Erica Badu featuring Stephen Marley. Me by Oshun. And that group's name is spelled O-S-H-U-N. Okay. And then we have Whip Appeal by Babyface, Indiana Homegrown. I Like It by Switch. You and chills on my spine every time. Um, and we have more than words by extreme our underlying energy is diamonds and pearls by the purple one prince okay so whoo there's a lot of masculine energy here but there is also some uh really kind, loving, intuitive um, energy that is flowing around as well. So, um, this feels to me like a mutual energy between you and someone or them towards you, you and... Uh, uh, any given situation take it how it applies you can um, <clears throat> apply this to you you know getting the job that you want or in you know moving to a new location and actually being where you wish to be so take it how it applies now I guess you are also vibrating on very much um, uh, collective level you are very much feeling your environment and doing what it is that you feel that you need to be doing at this time cancer that's some good energy when you are doing what you feel like you need to be doing and you are vibrating in that energy on a high frequency you're on a high frequency and vibrating there that's good that's good that's good and it just seems like it has a lot to do with, um, it has a lot to do with your environment, okay? Uh, high communication, high frequency communication, this could also be, um, you or a loved one expressing yourselves to each other. Um, this could also be um, a boss or someone in a um, higher ranking position, say, you know, for instance, uh, a boss or um, manager, um, a teacher, what have you, could be um, holding back some feelings and those things could be coming to the surface okay or you are holding some things back that um that you feel like you need to express on 
um, on the level of wisdom and um, education and this could you know come come across as very shocking to someone okay but it's very from a place of you sitting back and getting understanding and a place of wisdom all right cancer it seems like um, you are getting into an alignment of your place space and energy and doing so um, again from a high frequency this is you know having come into the understanding of what your what your job is right now and what you want to be doing with something I'm making a mess so hopefully you're not <laughs> all right cancer what's the message I'm also getting the the sense that there was once um, some really fiery passionate energy <laughs> coming from you in a in a past situation but you're seeing it in a in a better light you're more aligned with this energy that you were once feeling and be it um, an energy of um, <clears throat> lust or um, desire to a place of uh, understanding and uh, a place of learning that could happen okay and this is really like you know it's what you've wanted it to be there's something but something that you wanted to happen but really didn't expect it to come to fruition is actually you know it, it's actually here but you had to um this was on you to take some action in order for you to get to actually get this and understand what this is for you and again if you need to book a personal so we can so we can delve into what this is for you personally very very well we can very much get into that the information is in the description box you you've healed some 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 stuff that's been heavy on you as far as um, understanding how to nurture and understanding where your your nourishment comes from and being in that place and space of having dealt with this is this is kind of piggybacking off of the um the message from last week i believe this is you know seeing getting the epiphany of seeing your shadow side or seeing an energy that um, within you needed to be healed seeing something that um, really is a space and place of understanding what you want what you need what you have to have what was not given to you previously but moving forward this I this is this is a lot of change here there's a lot of change here cancer and it's really really it's a peaceful transition it goes from um having been in this energy of angst and aggression to vibrating and understanding it's you know of course there's glitches every now and again but there's still this there is a reverence and a respect for a place of healing and a lot of this energy i feel has to do with um feminine energy mothering energy you know take it how it doesn't necessarily have to be mom this could be any um female energy within your within your life this is very well be your feminine energy within you 
with you um, being a male cancer, you learning how to um, properly nurture yourself and uh, also learning how to receive nurturing from someone who is um, trying to give to you in a very balanced way rather than it being something that you are uh, you're foreign to and trying to push away you're inviting this energy in this is good this is very 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 good cancer very good I'm proud of you all right hold on guys I gotta turn something a lot of healing energy here cancer it's, there's also a, an energy or a feeling of someone hiding deep emotions because they want to come across as very um, very stoic and just very you know this could be an earth sign, somebody who does not show their emotions very well, very clearly. But um, the, the, the subtleties within their actions will show you that there is um, there's deep healing and deep feelings there. Okay? You know, the, the energy of also um, a very, very masculine male who um, is overly masculine, where he goes into that, that realm of um, toxic masculinity where, you know, he that whole um, king calm beating your chest kind of thing because I am the alpha male this is also that energy being dialed back because there's um, there's understanding and there's there's this could possibly be um, someone in that comes into your life that brings those kinds of energies to your attention okay where you can kind of you know relax a little bit um, relax the 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 level of overthinking and coming out of anxiety and just you know making the choice and the decision to be balanced there's you know there when you are not in balance that's when those things come up that's when you get triggered that's when you can't make decisions so that learning to self care and step back so that you can be um, the best version of yourself yeah and you just you it's baby steps cancer baby steps take baby steps to you know you're not going to get everything right all at one time and that's cool but you know the the effort those small steps forward those that making the decision that hey this is what has to go and this is what's going to stay in order for me to move forward and just one foot in front of the other the that one step that you take god moves a mountain okay so bring yourself back into that level of balance for yourself nurturing yourself knowing how to care for yourself instead of um needing the outside world to care for you um in a way that nobody's not nobody's ever going to do for you the way that you do for you but you can come into alignment with people and understandings with people that are on your same wavelength okay so i'm going to leave that there the signs that you could possibly be dealing with are um earth signs and those are the only signs that i see at this time um taurus virgo capricorn very much grounding energy you go from 
one extreme to the next okay from you know your loving watery energetic gooey loving self to the other extreme of putting your foot down okay so take that how it applies cancer if you need to book a personal the information is in the description box i love you i love you from my soul and i send you all blessings and light take care